a state election in New South Wales, we will touch close on 5 million people. On that election event and on that day, we have to make sure that everything will work. Information technology, I think, has brought a lot of benefits to the democratic process, in particular where it can improve the accuracy of the things that human beings are not as good at, and that is counting votes. I'm Colin Barry, and I'm the Electoral Commissioner at the New South Wales Electoral Commission. A lot of the work that we do is repetitive work and requires high degrees of accuracy. CGI have been a very important partner. We need people to partner with us in developing systems who understand the critical nature of our business. Virtually every facet of the electoral process has some technology involvement. And we are, although not entirely dependent on it, we are using it increasingly to achieve our outcomes and also to better manage the processes. I'm Ian Brightwell, I'm the Director of Information Technology and I'm also the CIO of the New South Wales Electoral Commission. We are an event organisation. When we're not in the middle of an election, the size of the organisation is really only about 60 people. When we're actually in the midst of the event, we have on election day about 20,000 employees. Being an event and being an immovable date for the election, technology is particularly challenging for us because, as most people are aware, delivering computer systems is a hazardous affair at the best of times. CGI first started working with the Electoral Commission in 1994. So we've worked with them for over 21 years. We've developed over seven of their major systems here in the Electoral Commission. And as these systems have to scale, as more and more people use these systems, they have to be designed correctly up front to allow that to happen without changes afterwards. We need to have an organisation like CGI who are big enough who can bring the right resources, the right skills from wherever to help with the projects. And that's one of the things that I like about partnering with CGI. We are here to support their IT needs, to support their constituents for the elections. One of the newer systems that we've implemented is the iVote system. And iVote allows people to vote electronically. Once this election is finished, we will have the largest number of votes of any internet voting system globally. At the last state election in 2011, we had about 47,000 electors who voted on the internet. This time round, we think that number will grow substantially and it could be up to about 200,000 people. In the past, if you weren't on the electoral roll, you couldn't actually vote. Now we allow people who turn up in a polling place to provide some identification and we use a piece of technology which is not dissimilar to a mobile phone. To be able to manage those problems and minimise them occurring, you've actually got to track in some detail an awful lot of ballot papers. That type of innovation and change through technology has allowed us to provide a better service to the public. 